I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting to get to episode four because episode three was out of left field, bro. Like way out of left field and I wasn't ready for it. But today I'm ready for whatever y'all throw at me because we already ripped the bandaid off last last episode. So you guys were more than helpful in answering a lot of our questions. So that was very appreciated. Mm -hmm. I'm sure we'll have many more. So please keep educating us. It's very, uh, <laughs> very entertaining and interesting learning all this stuff. Yeah. Also, uh, I went and I looked at because I didn't want to I didn't want to spoil myself, but I did want to see what happened in the sorry there's like campaign. a bee trying to suck me off anyway keep oh, going. oh what a bee <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> why would it want to suck you bro <laughs> anyway i went and looked at the campaign when this happened it's funny how how into it the people who were playing are like it's crazy how into it they are and it's like i don't i've never understood dungeons and dragons um that's what they're playing right D. &D. yeah 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 <laughs> um i never understood it but like watching it play out and everybody was so emotional and the people in the comments were so emotional i was like damn y'all was really into this shit i'm so glad they animated it because i don't know if i would have been able to watch the campaign like that yeah. <laughs> like i don't know and then like it made me go i wonder if i could play in a campaign like a DD campaign like i wonder if mm. i would be like good at it like acting it out and you know what i'm saying like i don't know world building and shit i just i just found it interesting so but yeah, yeah. i watched the campaign of uh vax anyway you already know what to do if you like this video don't forget to like subscribe hit the bells all that stuff check out the patreon it's all in the description and uh we're gonna get to it <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> Why were you in a box? They didn't hurt you, did they? No. I think they figured I'm worth more alive. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, look. Mm. They've hurt him. Oh, <gasps> that's the bear. It's okay. We won't hurt you. What are you doing? I can't just leave him here. What? Imagine picking up a what bear like a baby, do? bro. Raise a damn bear? <laughs> Mike, you are. There's nothing to heal. Damn, she's dead, dead. Somebody do something! We could try resurrecting her. A revival, right? Mm. I, I've never tried that before. Yeah, not many have. It's hard as hell to pull off, so we gotta do it while the body's still warm. Here, help Shit. me. Here we go. Oh, this is what people were talking about in the comments. You gotta do a yeah, roll or whatever? Happening. Who was with her? Can we maybe move back somewhere else? We're underneath a lake. There is no somewhere else. There's, there's got to be another potion or something. It's no use. She's done. This, I don't like this, bro. I don't like this shit at all. Oh. Is he like being drawn to the armor or something? Because he was seeing visions of the raven. I think that's her right there, right? There my buggy. Mm. Yeah, I don't think anybody else can see her. Oh. Vex. No. Come on. What's happening? Oh, God. No. Oh, no. Wow. You. What? No. Take me instead, you rape. I knew it was going to be a trade. Damn. Yup, it's a trade. Flip, bro. So we're losing somebody anyway. Oh. Oh, easy. Oh, oh my god. Oh, I can't believe you pulled that off. Holy shit. I'm amazing. You fucking died. Krog. No, <laughs> you fucking died. That's crazy. We turned around and you're just laying there stone cold. How are you wearing it? Oh, I, I don't know. I'm so confused as to what just happened. So they had like a connection and it was severed, but it wasn't his life. I don't know. I think his time is running out. I think that's just like a mark. 
that's all. Being able to wear that, you know? Uh-huh. I feel like that's just like a mark or something. Yeah. There's no I way she just help your friend. She just like Hmm. Brought her back to life Fair and then point. gave him armor. Like, there's no way that's how it works. One of them sure. is dead. Maybe the deal was that his sister lives and in return he has to work for her somehow. It is a heavy price, my boy. And I'm real worried about it. I don't know. Maybe he's OP now. <laughs> oh, shit. Are these all the different, like, gods or something of the vestiges? That's what it looks like. Was that the previous bearer of the armor? Mmm, looks like it. You worry too much, love. If they're worthy, don't call the me armor. love unless we smash it. Well, this will be child's <laughs> play for them. God, you might be right though. It's t- it's time to find out what that armor does. <laughs> Damn! Now you're destroying the. Oh my God! Somebody gonna pay a heavy toll. Bollocks! Bollocks! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, Grog. Oh, oh shit. Damn, so he's just sitting there having visions while everybody else is fighting for their life. I can't be a part of this. I won't. Damn it, Cash. I like that name, Cash. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so she summoned it and she can't control it? Oh, get him back in the locket. <laughs> I'm not going back in that lo- that locket. Bro, I just died. Oh my god. Not bear. Oh my god. I got the armor now, fam. Yeah. Give me the sword and the helmet. Oh, he's kneeling. Hail the new champion. Damn, he looked like Shredder. Ooh. It's kind of fire, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that shit looks funny, bro. <laughs> You're right. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> we 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 stupid we we oh my <laughs> I got gotcha. you dead facts I was doing that he looks cool as fuck bro it has to be I'm the main character now <laughs> stole that shit oh <laughs> <laughs> Not my good eye. That glow is so awesome. Yeah. I want to apologize. I was careless. Sometimes we have a habit of moving too quickly. I don't want to hear it right now. I rushed in and it nearly got Vex killed. No, no, it did get her killed. I don't know what I would have done different. Bro- oh, yeah. Damn. Right. That went well. <laughs> he told you he didn't want to hear it. What the fuck? Wait, I want you to have this. Ooh, you might this? need it on the road ahead. Hey, you know how Trinket keeps you know getting left know. outside the cities? Oh, no, Why don't they just put the bear in there and... I need a way to keep you out of danger. Oh, shit. Wow, you are two for two today, bro. Oh, come on, just try it. Shit. Maybe you need to do the, the villain glasses thing. <laughs> <laughs> I got an 
searched. It's a Pokeball. <laughs> True. <laughs> what is she, the fucking Reaper, bro? Oh. Hey, we are Jesus. Ah. Brother, whatever this all means, we'll figure it out. Mm. Nothing's changed. Everything's changed, bro. Everything's changed. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Where's my glasses, bro? Yeah. I thoroughly enjoyed that. That was uh, the best episode, well, since the first episode of the season. So <laughs> I'm glad, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I really like the first episode of the season, and I really like this one a lot. In terms of like a D and D perspective, one thing I was wondering is when Vax got that armor, essentially he got like a buff, right? Mm -hmm. What happens in the D and D campaign? Like, this is a multi-faceted question, I guess. When you start out, how do you determine your character's stats? Like, how do you determine that they're smart or strong or whatever? Mm. Um, and then once that's sort of been established, what happened to Vax's stats when he gained this armor did he get like 20 to all stats because he's you know like agility and strength or some shit or dex whatever it is i mean he's clearly a lot more powerful and nimble i don't want to sound super basic but i think i might have a new favorite character so <laughs> oh my god <laughs> who was your first favorite character percy no it was the uh the dragon uh what's his name oh, thor deck yeah, yeah, the yeah. cinder king yeah, yeah, yeah. he's cool He's, he's super cool. I wonder if this even happened in the campaign. You know, like I wonder if if the trade happened because like people in the comments were saying, "No, she's dead, dead." But oh, you know what? They were probably playing on words, like because she actually died, and they didn't want to yeah. spoil it for us. So since she actually died, they were confirming that she's dead. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So maybe that's what was what was going on. Then we're using our fucking brains this episode, bro. <laughs> <laughs> But um, yeah, yeah, I wonder if this happened in, 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 the, in the campaign, you know, and how they played it. Like, I'd be curious to watch, like, how he's, like, the, the guy who's actually playing Vax. Like, if he's, like, zipping around the room and shit. Or if he's, like, <laughs> making, like, sound effects. Like, huh, ha, huh. I, I mean, I don't think so. <laughs> I think they sit at the table for the most part. But uh, yeah. I'm sure they do some impromptu acting every now and then. Um, but that's a good point you raised. Do they add a lot more to the story that uh, wasn't in the original campaign? How closely do they stick to the original campaign in terms of this adaptation into animation form? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so many questions. But uh, fantastic episode. I'm sure there's a lot more to talk about, but we want to get into the next episode. So, mm, This is Keyleth's place? Mm. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Are these no, guys just like avatars or some shit? <laughs> Wind, yeah. Fire. And the earth and water. Yeah, they're avatars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they did that shit in Avatar, actually. It's, ah, fuck. Never pull back. See? Hmm. Flame cannot live without air, and we are air Ashari, are we not? We were made to pass through fire. That's cool. Mm, I'm gonna try that. <laughs> yeah, assuming that's her mother, what if she went on a journey and just never came back? Well, they say the journey takes mad long. It really puts life into perspective, you know? I feel more grown, <laughs> more mature. Oh my hey, god. I look more mature. Yeah. I'm going to take that as a compliment because of how mature I am. <laughs> Vax gets it, right, brother? Sure. This guy's like traumatized and she's over there talking shit. I mean, granted, she's the one who died, so whatever. No. Damn, bro, like, if you want me to be your vestige or whatever, can you just, like, leave me alone until it's time? Like, I don't need all the vi vi visions and shit. Does he see ditch? Is that the thing? Huh. Uh, I'll land here. No. What did you. How did you do that? What'd you say? Vituna? Viridian? Voluptuous? Mm, venereal. Hey, yo. What? Uh, guys, there's a volcano and it is more pissed off than Vex. What? The rift to the fire plane is there. If it's erupting, then Pyro. The fire.
Fire Shari could be in trouble. Then they'll have to deal with it themselves. I'm sorry, Keyleth. But Osisa's instructions were very clear. Bro. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> that doesn't look good at all, bro. Oh, shit! Damn. More are coming through. We need help. What the Dad? hell is going on? Oh, wow. Mm. It was a dragon. Oh, he my God. Waste to our people. <coughs> this dude is missing a whole arm. You remember Sir Konos? Of course. Winds watch you, Headmaster. And you, Keyleth. I came as soon as I could. But our brothers and sisters were already decimated. <laughs> if we can't find a way to close the rift soon. Oh, I see it. It's definitely like a portal. And remain mm. open forever. So is there one for like air, Normally, water, and earth as well? But no freaking way, Kila! Kima? Halura! <laughs> she's still she's still <laughs> shooting the shit. Why is he hugging? <laughs> this is the perfect opportunity to fit yeah. Don't you fight fire with? Fire me. <laughs> 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 Well, I'm trying, but none of these guys got bloody insides. What was that, buddy? Uh, I just got <laughs> me some blueberry pie. <laughs> what? It's, it's very flammable. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably the most flammable, actually. All that gunpowder yeah. in his, his trench coat. Kalora <laughs> fucking Vysorin. Not my middle name, but I'll see you as well. <laughs> Quickly, Keyleth and her father need our help. <laughs> Fucking is my middle name. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine? We knew if Thordak was free, it meant the rift was open. Hold up, Thordak uh. came through Pyra. How did you even know it was him? Because we are the reason he escaped. Huh? Years ago, Kima and I battled Thordak with a group not unlike yours. Damn, he's such but a cool fucking dragon. Like an arcane tether, it pulled Thordak into the fire plane. Imprisoning him there forever. Or so we thought. So how is it your fault? Because, like, you couldn't kill him, so you Stop. sealed him away. Like, I, I, how is that your fault that he's back? Together! <laughs> Oh, it's working! Ah, yeah. Of course, oh, it's no. time. Wake up your inner Sorry. powers. Yo, mom? Let's go to Sala. I think she's the strongest out of the group. Mm hmm. Mm. I was made to pass through fire. <laughs> I'm so afraid because last season I was like, nobody's dying. This season, I'm like, anybody could die. Fuck. Fucking heal it, bro. Wow. Damn. Damn. <laughs> she turned into Pyron? From Darkstalkers? <laughs> But damn, do you, did you not come out? That whole sequence was so well animated. Hell yeah, it was. They've really stepped it up this season. Every episode is so beautiful. <laughs> mm -hmm. Keyleth the God! So remember how I said Vex was my favorite character? <laughs> I think I think Caleb. This guy is swapping characters every episode. <laughs> I think you'll be needing this. There's a different staff I'ma need. <laughs> From this day forward, you have the blessing of Pyra. Damn. Your water and earth trials await you on your Aramente. But go forth, knowing you have mastered fire. Thank you, Flamespeaker. 
I couldn't have asked for better companions for my dear Keyleth. Until we meet again, please take care of each other. <laughs> Especially that one. Ooh. Man, I mean, that was two back-to-back -back amazing episodes. Keyleth displayed her power, her competence. She got her certification, yeah. <laughs> mastery over flames, fire. So yep. a very cool episode. Enjoyed it. Yeah, she got a whole tunic change. Yeah, I mean, I wonder what happens when she does all the elements, right? And then she just wears whatever she wants. I don't know. <laughs> I don't wear jeans and a tank top. <laughs> Yo, it's getting bigger. What are we talking about? <laughs> the sword. Talking too big. <laughs> uh, no, the, the trees. <laughs> yeah, Caliph taught me. <laughs> oh, good luck with the termites, tree. <laughs> you notice Grog acting strange? I mean, he's real dumb. It's kind of hard to tell. <laughs> <laughs> he's so focused on that sword. Come here. Oh, oh, hey, Grog, what are you Don't you worry, Scanlan. Uncle Grog is going to keep no, I... you warm. <laughs> <laughs> This is actually kind of cozy. If I was walking for ages, I'd be like, yeah, just carry me, bro. I wouldn't mind at all. Word. This kind of reminds me of, like, Oblivion. They're yeah. always in, like, different different dungeons and shit. We were sent by Osisa. My mate sent you. I am Kamal Giori, keeper of the knowledge you mm. seek. But before I reveal it, you must prove your worth in the challenge. challenge. Yes, we sort of assumed. Conquer the 70 death gorgons. Oh my god. Survive the endless labyrinth of misery. Oh my god. Or wound me. Oh my god. Sorry. Uh... Did you say wound you? Death gorgons so cool as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I would probably do that do out of the others. He's never felt pain. Never stubbed his toe, poked his eye, never had an ingrown hair on his peen. You want to fight that? Oh, God. I've never had I that either. It. Neither, no. <laughs> <laughs> Surely Vax with his vestige can do something. Yeah, right. I'd hope so. Oh, bro, this shit looks like God of War. Each of you will have a chance like to Dragon Ball Super. Super. a one on one. Oh, true, true. Who dares go first? A heavy burden being the Matrix champion. Mm. Yeah, Fortunately for me. You will live long enough to feel its weight. Damn. Whoa! Vax! Um. What did you do to him? Fuck you! Oh, poor girl. You have no family left who actually cares for you. Damn, bro. These sphinxes? What's the assholes? Quite <laughs> formidable, yeah. but you clearly know not where your strength comes from. Yeah, they said this. The second said? person who said that tone, yeah. Wait, there's gotta be another way. I... Scanlon's gonna come oh, and clutch. Hell yeah. He's gonna like insult him or something. Maybe he'll forget about me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> shit. Osisa to put her faith in your lot. Cause she likes my meat, bitch. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> He's gonna make his heart hurt. Wish you could see her. <laughs> oh no. As the days go by. <laughs> this shit is so good. Because of you, I feel pain. <laughs> you have wounded my heart. Oh my you gotta be God. kidding me. That worked. Just what can't rhymes help. with your eyes so lovely? How about 
Nice thighs, yo, touch me? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> <What>? Fuck. <laughs> oh, you're back. Great. Uh, come over. It's totally cool, guys. Me and Cam are tight. <laughs> Cam. In my millennia of existence, <laughs> this is the wisest sage I've ever known. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> oh, yo. Ooh. Who gets that? The vestige known as Myth Carver. Connected to all myths and legends. Do they all get one? The other vestiges. That would be cool. Myth Carver, show me something good. <laughs> Scanlan the god. Guys, I'm somewhere else. I see mm. something inside this gnarly tree. There's a bow? Vex, some badass looking bow. There's a bunch of dudes who look like Grog. Mm. One's got a vestige. Big giant gauntlets. Mm. Glowing. Uh, it's probably not important. Yeah. It's a dragon? Oh, it's a down. fucking dragon. Who's strong as a sphinx right. or the dragon? You have my things, gnome. For finding me a vestige. Oh! Jeez. We gotta jump Shit. In. With Cam on our side, we can actually beat this fucker. Split up. I love that. Damn, they're actually gonna take him out. Nice. Mm. Nice. Oh no. no. Oh no! Nice. Fuck. <laughs> no! Damn, but we lost the sword. Thank you for showing me Osisa once more. Oh no. Wow. That's fucked up. Oh, let's go, Grog. Let's go, Grog. Mm. Hurry! Nah, Grog. I think Grog's gonna fucking kill this thing. Oh, or not. Uh. <laughs> or not. He's actually fighting a dragon. Bro. Oh! Yeah. What are you doing? We gotta leave. He's about to kill this thing. Oh no! Come on, big guy! Move! Too much shit's happening. Yeah. Damn, where did we get set though? I, I don't know. And where's Krog? And yeah, they got split off somewhere. Where are we? Fuck. This, this shit. It's just like I okay. said. Last, okay, okay, okay. Last season, I <sighs> felt like these fucking guys were untouchable. This season, everybody's fucking touchable. I hope Pike's not dead. She's like the healer of the group, so I don't know if she can heal herself. Uh, she seems to be out of commission at the very least. Uh, maybe they got sent to a town and they can be healed there. I don't know. I mean, that whole thing with Grog accidentally hitting someone was foreshadowed for a very long time, the whole season. So I'm not surprised that happened, but I'm surprised how it happened. Yeah. Uh, that was very untimely. Yeah. I feel like he was going to smoke that dragon, though. I don't know, man. He was putting up a fight. We got to get rid of that sword. Sword's got to go. Like, like you said, I think he's going to get those, you know, the vestige from that person he seems to know with the gauntlets. Mm -hmm. uh, he's probably going to end up with those. And I'm not sure if they specified how many there were. I feel like they said there was eight vestiges or something like that. So there's going to be one for every person, I think. But uh, at the very least, they know where 
a lot of them are because uh, Scanlan saw with the sword. Mm-hmm. So they at least know the locations of them. Yeah. So that's where they're going next. But, I mean, that's probably going to happen later. I wonder if they're even going to find all of them in this season because we're halfway through now mm. and we've got one, right? We found a second one, but we don't have it anymore. So. Yeah. This season has been has been a, a ride. This has been a ride. It's well worth the wait. And it wasn't even a long wait. Yeah. It was a short wait. And it's just better. <laughs> just- it is way better. Those three episodes flew by. It didn't even feel like it was an hour and some minutes. That was uh, excellent entertainment. Hell so yeah. Just the pacing in general. I would have been perfectly fine with that episode ending uh, with like the Sphinx hanging out with Scanlan and shit. Mm-hmm. But then we got more with like the dragon coming mm-hmm. and man, I, I, I feel like I want to watch the D and D like <laughs> a clip or like 20 minutes or so when the dragon just shows up randomly and they're like, what the fuck? Yeah. Cause that would be great. But yeah, it's great just, episodes. It's yeah. crazy how this show like came from a D and D campaign. Hmm. You know, like, that campaign must have been ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shit. Do you play D&D? No, of course not. Um, like, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I don't mean that in a bad way, but no, I, I haven't uh, done any D&D stuff. Like I mentioned previously, I'd watched a little bit of the Vox Machina campaign, I think, or maybe it was uh, another one, but I've seen a bit of... Uh, critical roles campaigns but i never really got too far into it i think i watched like five sort of episodes and they're like three hours long each right so Mm. yeah i didn't get too far into them but they're interesting and i can definitely see the appeal and i would be uh interested in like sort of trying it in my own time but you definitely need someone who knows uh, what they're doing to sort of lead you and all that kind of stuff Uh, and it seems to be quite a big undertaking but Mm -hmm. uh, i mean i'm definitely curious at the least so yeah that's cool me personally, I don't know if I don't know if I'd be any interest it interesting. Like I don't know if y'all would be interested to see that. Or like if anybody would be interested to see me do it. Like I don't know if I yeah. if I'm interesting enough to do it, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So Yeah. But um Yeah man, this shit was fire. The the these three episodes were crazy. Like yeah. how many near death experiences did we have in just these three episodes, bro? Like fuck. What a great show. Yeah. What a great show. I'm I'm so glad we're watching this. Thanks for watching this with me, my boy. Um, thanks for watching this with us on YouTube and Patreon. I appreciate all of you. Thank you for all the kind words and the comments and stuff like that and all the information you give us. Thank you for your patience. And, uh, man, you already know what to do with that like button, the subscribe button, the bell button, the description button, the Patreon button. You already know what to do with all of those, so I don't even need to tell you. Thank you so much. And, uh, man... Let us know what you thought in the comments. (laughs) And we will see you in the next one.